All right, I'll start the video now. If you were having problems with IntelliSense, working with Visual Studio Basic or Code with Unity, and you're using a Mac, I could not, for the life of me, find out how to turn on IntelliSense. It wouldn't come on. It wouldn't work. Well, I finally found a solution. It's actually a really quick solution. Mind you, I'm not using the computer that had the problem. My problem was on my Apple laptop. However, I will show you how I did it. It's a very easy fix. Now, it depends which Unity version you're on. So if you're, in, if you're on 2019 and under, I believe, you go to Edit, and then you go to Preferences. Uh, but let me just wait for this to finish loading my project. So if you have 2019, you go to Preferences, and then... Uh, you look for, I believe, is external tools, um, and you regenerate project files. Yeah, that will fix it for 2019. But for 2020, 2020, you go to Window, and then you go to Package Manager. Yeah, trust me, guys, this works. You go to Package Manager, and then you look for Visual Studio Editor. Here it is, Visual Studio Editor, update it. Once you update it, you should not have a problem. And if you do add a, if you do have a problem even after upgrading the Visual Studio Editor, or you could get the Code Editor, but the edit, Visual Studio Editor is what fixed it for me. After updating, it was fine. Mind you, on this computer, it was already working. So let's just open up a script just to see what we're looking at here. So if I open up a project normally, normally my computer's a little dated now. It's a little dated. It's a little slow. If anybody would like to donate to a, a faster YouTube channel, please let me know. Anyways, uh, one, one thing you can't do with uh, without IntelliSense is the for loop. So let's try creating a for loop. And there it is for each for... Let's just create a for loop. And if you press tab, it will automatically make it for you. So for each tab, there it is. Uh, if we want to look at on draw gizmos, it's all here. It gives you that, that all you have to do is select which one you want. So there you go, guys. Easy fix, whether you're on 2019 or 2020 or 2021 or 20 whatever. This is a fix that should work for you. Anyways, guys, I think that is it. If you have anything else to add, please add it in the comments. And uh, we'll take it from there. So fix your Unity and your Visual Studio at IntelliSense so that you could see what options you have and what you can do about your current situation. Anyways, guys, like the video, comment, subscribe. That's it for this one. Till the next one, cheers.